would still go in. Yeah. Last time I was here was Grandma and Grandpa. There's the uh, Northwest Overland Rally. Um, we are leaving. We're heading home for a few days and then heading out to Oregon. Um, but we are taking the scenic route home, which adds about two, three, two, roughly two and a half hours. Um, so, yeah, looking forward to it. We are on another adventure. This adventure is on our way home, but we are taking the scenic route. And last night at the Northwest Overland Rally, um, Brendan, um, formerly from Boondocking Bros, um, and I don't know if he's, I should talk to him about that. I don't know if he's gonna start up his YouTube again. Uh, but after Shelby passed, that kind of changed a lot of his focus. And I'm hoping, you know, that he can get back into it and you know carry on for his brother um because you know between the two of them they did a really good job and you know they're family so that's special to me as well we grew up together and our dads grew up together so there's that you know, two brent uh, cadence friends with um their boys but Caden's like younger than them so there's a difference in age, um, but they live off in Idaho, so which kind of sucks. But it's nice when we can get together. So he's three hours that way. We're three hours that way. It's meeting in the middle. But see you soon, Brendan. It's nice seeing you again. Um, it's always good to see family. <laughs>
here, so obviously they're dealing with it. Fire truck up there. Where? On the hill there. Oh, it's still going. back in Canada and I can definitely tell by the driving holy cow um, anyway that was a fun scenic route uh, very windy roads um, stop got gas talked to another overlander guy um, nice fellow and um, we uh, are now back gotta unpack to repack soon but I want to unpack stuff so I can kind of um, simplify things a little bit more for heading to Oregon um, I want one less container so I think I know what I'll do there um, I'll probably take the barbecue out so that we can have more space um, but I'm always trying to think of space wise of carrying stuff and also your payload uh, the more weight you've got the more fuel you're gonna use the harder is in your vehicle etc etc um, but yeah, that's another rock. out this waterfall and I do not like this bridge. When I can see through a bridge. It's better than a glass bridge. I'm not a big fan. And when a car goes by and the whole bridge shakes, not my idea of fun. 